going on guys? Welcome to the Community Channel. Today, we are going to be recording <clears throat> the first ever Assassin's Creed Mondays. So yeah, this is the series where we play every Assassin's Creed starting from the first one and ending with Brotherhood because those are the only three I have. So yeah, let's hop into it. What's going on guys? Like I said, welcome to the Community Channel. I'm, it's Doctor. The reason I say that is because there's going to be other people recording on the channel soon. Beast Brother, maybe Zombie Beast Mode. Uh, Dragon Wolf, maybe. People like that. Anyways, we're playing Assassin's Creed today. I am extremely pumped because I like Assassin's Creed. Just pretty good games. And yeah, tomorrow I'm going to be recording Trial Tuesday. It's a new series I came up with where I start off with every single trial from A to Z in every category. And it's just, just playing. It's lagging at link. That's okay. But you know, people guess I have to deal with a little lag because, you know. Tried fixing it, nothing else I can do. It's green. Look at the capture card, it's green. So, you know, it, 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 it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Let's just skip. Alright. Let's start. Okay. Yep, new game. So, we're going to be playing a new game, Head Eye Guys. What is happening? It's loading. Lock your eyes, everybody. It's bright. What's happening? Everything's just blinking. Why is this the loading screen? Everything's just blinking! Oh, this is gonna be the whole video? The loading screen? Ah, here we go. What the fuck? I applied my heart to no wisdom, and to no madness and folly. I perceived that this also was a chasing after wind. For in much wisdom is much grief. And he that increaseth knowledge, increaseth sorrow. What? We've got a problem. I can't anchor him to the memory. Too much psychological trauma. He's rejecting the treatment. Retreating. Desmond, I need you to try. What's happening? Let me try and stabilize him. Focus. Listen to the sound of my voice. Recognize that what you're seeing isn't real. Just a picture of the past. It can't hurt you. Damn it. It's not working. Give it a moment, Miss Stillman. He'll adjust. The first time is never easy. We're losing him. What's happening? Enough, Miss Stillman. We need to pull him out. Now. All right, Desmond. We're going to try and bring you out. What? What just happened? Alright, so apparently I'm this guy named Desmond, and shit was just blinking. You okay? I told you he'd be fine. Bastards! Now, now, I just saved your life. Saved my life? You kidnapped me. You strapped me into that thing. Animus. It's an animus. I don't even know you people. Why are you doing this to me? You have information we need, Mr. Miles. Information? I'm a bartender, for Christ's sakes. What do you want me to do, teach you how to mix a martini? <laughs> I know who you are, what you are. I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play coy with me. There isn't time. You're an assassin. And whether you realize it or not, you've got something that my employers want. Locked away in that head of yours. But I'm not an assassin. Not anymore. Yes, your file indicated as much. Something about an escape. Most fortunate for us. What do you want from me? For you to do as you're told. The Animus will allow us to locate what we need. Once we have it, you'll be free to go. I am not going back in there. 
Then we'll induce a coma and continue our work. When we're done, you'll be left to die. Truth be told, the only reason you're still conscious is because this approach saves us time. You're insane. So what is it, Mr. Miles? Live or die? <laughs> Lie down. Yes, yeah, so apparently I'm gonna live. A wise decision. I'm going into this weird thing. All right, all right, let's. Looks like it's loading. Where am I? You're inside the animus, which is, it's a projector that renders genetic memories in three dimensions. Genetic memory. Seems you'll need a bit of a tutorial. Very well. We'll start simple. What is a memory? Mr. Miles? It's the recollection of a past event. Specific to the individual okay, for some reason we can't even event. see the freaking link. Yeah, sure. <laughs> what if I told you that the human body not only housed an individual's memory, but the memories of his ancestors as well? Genetic memory, if you will. Migration, hibernation, reproduction. How do it's animals eagle. know when and where to go? What to do? That's just animal instinct. Now you're arguing semantics, Mr. Miles. Whatever you call it, the fact remains. These creatures oh, are these guys are speaking mumbo jumbo to me. First hand experience. I've spent the past 30 years trying to understand why. I discovered something most fascinating. Our DNA functions as an archive. It contains not only genetic instructions passed down from previous generations. Why do they look why are Q tips being like well. white and blue? What the, the hell's happening? And the Animus lets you decode and read these DNA files. Precisely. But there's a problem. This is the specific memory we're trying to access. Unfortunately, when we try and open the memory, your mind withdraws. You lack the confidence to step into your ancestor's body. That's what happened earlier. You got knocked out of the target memory and pushed back to a more stable state. Why? It's your subconscious. It's resisting. We found similar reactions among patients who undergo hypnosis to relive traumatic events. They can't jump directly into the specific memory. They need to be eased in. Even then, there can be problems. So how do we fix it? We find a memory you can synchronize with, and we move forward from there. You'll get used to it. This is the closest we can Jeez. get to, so it's where we'll have to start. I'm uploading the tutorial program now. The tutorial program, I look like a G. Walk down the road, assassin. Oi. Hina. Hina. Okay, getting distracted. Alright, let's go. Warning Data stream unstable. Attempting to restore synchronization. Hello, Subject 17. This tutorial has been prepared in order to better acclimate oh. you to the Animus's control system. Instructions will follow shortly. Okay. The synchronization bar represents how in sync you are with your ancestors' memories. If you ever find that is your synchronization with your ancestors, the Animus okay. will restore you to your last synchronized position. You are currently dangerously close to desynchronization. All right. Please follow all forthcoming instructions in order to restore system stability. The Animus utilizes All right. a puppeteering concept to control the actions of your Head. ancestor. I'm loading subroutines to validate your body's adaptation to the Animus. We will begin by exploring the default actions of each input. Oh, I don't really like this. While standing still, use the head button to observe your environment. Okay, I see the people. Uh, that's it. Okay. Empty hand to walk through these jar carriers without causing them to drop what they're holding. Proceed to the marker to continue the synchronization process. Well, I failed that. Okay, I didn't work out too well. 
Press B, press and hold B, okay. <laughs> well, okay, that did not work out well. I always freaking fail at this. Press and hold B to push their feelings out of your way without making them drop. What do you mean? I am pressing and holding B. I didn't want to play this game because I'm not really good at this. Son of a bitch! I in a gentle push. I use the gentle push. <laughs> I hate this mission. I hate this mission with a dying passion. Okay, let's see. Gentle push. That was not a gentle push! Okay, I had to hold B and walk through. Wow. Okay. Well God, I, I hated that so much. So I had to press and hold B. Between two fundamental actions. Okay, I get it now. And high profile. Low profile actions are so. So press and hold the R T for action or mental moves. And release the R2 for socially acceptable. Well, so press and hold the R2 to see the heads up display changes the context of the puppeteering inputs. Excellent. Okay. We will continue your synchronization process by testing some high profile actions. Grab and throw this individual onto the marker by using the empty hand button in high profile. Wow. That's a throw? I don't call that a throw. I call that a push. That was not a throw, that was a push. So I'm pressing hold right trigger. There we go. Using your legs button in high profile will. will allow you to sprint. Sprinting is useful to escape so sprint from soldiers and or to get oh, closer to Oh yes. However, be careful not to bump into anyone, for you can lose your balance and tumble to the ground. While sprinting, 
Reach the marker before this man does. Ah! You bitch! Come on! You douche! Oh, 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 hold A. Dude, I'm so bad at this! Okay, hold on. Alright, 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 let's see. Press and hold and move the spawn. It's smart for the man does. Oh, it's my for the man does! That's right, screw you. The animus will all oh, get to assassinate somebody. Information. The social status icon gives you information on your social status. The different states will be explained in context soon. This icon appears when a soldier is looking at you. The yellow color means the soldier is either unaware or suspicious of who you are. To illustrate the change in awareness level, you will stealth assassinate this soldier. First, lock onto your target. Now, select your hidden blade. With your blade selected, walk up to the soldier and assassinate him by using your armed hand button. Damn! I just straight up assassinated that guy. What? Who's done this? He's like, no. The dead body has alerted the soldier and changed his awareness to informed, as represented by the red witness indicator. Aggressive actions or socially unacceptable okay. behavior undertaken at this time will likely provoke an armed response. Provoke this soldier. Let's do this. Notice how the social Stop status him. icon has changed to exposed. Use the ladder and try to break the line of sight. Excellent. The line of sight has been broken. Now, run into the roof garden to hide from the soldier. Good. Your social status indicates that you are hidden, but the soldier is still looking for you. Wait until your social status changes again. This is pointless. All right. Well done. The soldier has lost your track. You are now anonymous, <sighs> and you can exit the hide spot. Awesome. Excellent. That was fun. Being anonymous will fill your synchronization bar and make your job as an assassin easier. There are different places which you can use to hide. However, you must always break the line of sight first, and then use a hide spot to vanish. Alright. Let us continue with a demonstration of Blend. Blend can be activated with the passive use of your legs. You can mimic a scholar and pass near soldiers without arousing suspicion. Use this to reach the marker behind the soldiers. Um, I am not evil. Um. All right. Good. That's that. I just walk straight That's through you. Don't even notice me. Ability is available to you. 
Referred to as Eagle Vision, this sixth Eagle Vision ancestor understand the intentions of people around him. Well done. Red Eagles soldiers, blue Eagles allies. It's obvious, okay. Remember, Eagle Vision will only be available once you are fully synced. Please note that following the Assassin's Creed, your ancestors' way of life will assist you with staying in sync. The creed consists of three tenets. First, never hurt an innocent person. Second, always be discreet. Third, do not compromise the clan. Should you restore synchronization by reliving key moments of your ancestors' life, or by respecting the creed. You have successfully completed the, the, career, yo. the most stable memory block will now be loaded. Welcome to the Anonymous. So yeah guys, we're gonna end this video here with the first ever Assassin's Creed Mondays. Hope you guys enjoyed. Oh you hope you I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like, comment, rate, and subscribe. That's right, do it. Make sure you guys comment, rate, and subscribe. So yeah, I will see you guys next time. Doctor One is out.